Now your certified storm ready forecast from NBC 25. Well, it is December 1st and it is meteorologically the beginning of winter. Yes, December 1st, according to meteorologists and climatologists, we classify it as a winter month and it certainly felt like it this morning. As we take a live look outside right now, there isn't any snow uh, to be seen in Frankenmuth via NBC 25 Skycam. Uh, but we do have the possibility of a little bit of that or at least some wintry precipitation in the future. But for now, the uh, main story are the cold temperatures. Let's take a look right now in Saginaw. It is 19 degrees, but it feels more like seven skies are clearing out. It's also clearing in Flint, still hanging on to 24 degrees, but these temperatures will continue downward tonight with clear skies and it feels more like 15 outside in Flint. Take a look at these highs today. 34 in Burton, 32 in Auburn. You might be saying, when did this happen? Well, it probably happened when a lot of you were sleeping. These occurred by and large just after midnight, but that cold air, the 20s that we had for highs up in Harrison and West Branch continued to sag southward throughout the day and temperatures will continue to go downward with those clear skies tonight towards the lower teens in most areas. And I think we might even be five to 10 degrees colder in Gladwin and Standish than what our model is implying. So that means some single digits for you. Highs tomorrow getting close to the freezing mark in most areas. And then tomorrow night, not nearly as cold with more cloud cover and a south wind will go with upper 20s. And then as we head into Wednesday afternoon, highs will get a little bit closer to our average, which is in the upper 30s at this time of year, falling just a few degrees short of that. In terms of precip, we're not expecting anything for tonight. Tomorrow morning looking clear as we head into the afternoon, just a few extra clouds moving in. But a little disturbance in the upper levels may trigger some uh, uh, wintry precipitation, possibly a few flakes of snow, but we're actually more concerned about freezing drizzle very early on Wednesday morning. That could produce a little bit of black ice. It doesn't look like a major event, but something we'll keep an eye on over the next uh, 36 hours. Down to 12 on average tonight, obviously a lot colder in our northern counties where it's already close to 12 at this time, and then 32 for high tomorrow. Some increase in cloudiness in the afternoon, otherwise some chilly sunshine for a good part of the day. 27 tomorrow night with that chance of freezing drizzle. 36, lots of cloud cover on Wednesday, 33 degrees on Thursday. And then we have a little bit of a moderating trend. Our average high in the uh, upper 30s at this time of year, and we'll get close to that on Friday and into the low 40s with no snow in the forecast over the weekend, but possibly a rain snow mixture on Monday.